Hi, and thanks for joining us today to talk about Neo4j Bloom Enterprise. We have two versions of Bloom, a full access version and a basic access version. And in this video, we'll talk a little bit about some features that come with our full access enterprise version of Bloom. We have a few features that are helpful for bringing the power of graph to more users in your organization, rather than just developers or people comfortable writing cipher code and interacting with the database. We'll talk about those features in a little bit of detail and hopefully you'll find them useful. Bloom is a powerful visual graph exploration tool that lets you expose the power of Neo4j to more users in your organization because they don't have to be experts in writing Cypher or software developers. First, let's have a look at some of the features in the full access version of Bloom as compared to the free basic access version. If you go to neo4j.com forward slash Bloom and look at our website about halfway down, you'll find a feature comparison table that describes at a high level the differences between the two offerings. The first and perhaps most important difference is that basic access Bloom does not work with remote databases, only databases on your local machine. With the full access version of Bloom in the enterprise, you can access remote databases. We also offer scene saving and sharing, which is a powerful new feature found in Bloom 2.0, as well as perspective storage, which allows you to store perspectives centrally so that everyone in your organization who's authorized can access them. We also allow sharing of scenes and perspectives based on roles of the database users. Our self-managed enterprise users can take advantage of Neo4j Bloom full access by both downloading and placing a plugin file in the Neo4j instance. The Bloom Server plugin is available from the Neo4j Download Center at neo4j.com. And if you unpack the zip file under the Neo4j Bloom 2.0 distribution, you'll find plugin.jar files for both 4.x and 3.x versions of the database. With this plugin and a key file available from your Neo4j representative, you can unlock the power of Neo4j Bloom full access. Bloom can be installed in a number of different deployment modes for our self-managed customers, and details about how to configure Bloom for full access in conjunction with the plugin and the license key file are available on our documentation site, also found at neo4j.com. Bloom can be installed to run from the server plugin itself or on your own web server within your organization. Neo4j desktop users can also use Bloom to access remote databases when they have the licensed file and the plugin available. Let's talk a little bit more about the perspective sharing features unlocked by Bloom Full Access. Perspectives offer business views of the graph. In this example, you can see we have a perspective with all labels, a customer view, and an item view. Basic access Bloom users can share perspectives by exporting the perspective file and then sending it to someone who can use the import perspective button in the gallery to import it. However, with Bloom full access, the sharing tab is enabled in the perspective view, and you can actually select database roles with whom you'd like to share a given perspective. In this case, I'm sharing the all labels perspective with the reader, editor, and admin roles. Now, any users who have those database roles and connect to this database from Bloom should see the all labels perspective available to them for use. In the perspective, administrators can define which node labels are visible, default styling information, what they want to use as captions, and all kinds of other details, including relationships and which ones are visible, and search phrases. Search phrases are a powerful way to enable non-technical users to execute complex queries. Administrators can store search phrases in perspectives that have Cypher that suits the needs of the organization, and then users can run those queries from the near natural language search box in Bloom. So as you can see, perspective sharing offers a unique feature that easily enables organizations to extend the power of Neo4j and Bloom to more users in their organization. A powerful new feature that was introduced in Bloom 2.0 and that's only available to our Bloom Full Access Enterprise customers is scene saving and sharing. In this example, I'm looking for some transactions by customers from Australia. So I'll execute a graph pattern query to find some results. And we see that we get a node for Australia connected to some customer nodes and a number of transactions conducted by each customer. Now I'll save this, I'll just give the scene a more meaningful name, Transactions Australia, and maybe I want to do some other investigation at this moment. 
So I'll create a new scene by clicking the Add Scene button. And all of our data will still be in the Transactions Australia scene, but in the meantime, I can do something with categories and items, for example. Here, I've got some results showing which items are in which category, and I might want to save this one as well, and I'll just call it Categories. Now I can switch back and forth between these two scenes with ease. Users can create as many scenes as they need, and if they want to share scenes, they can use our export dialog to share scenes with different database roles. In this case, I'm going to add the admin and editor role. It's important to note that scenes can only be shared with roles for whom the perspective has already been shared, and scenes are attached to perspectives. You can see here that user one has already shared a scene with me called items in more than one category. I can't edit this scene because I don't own it. And we have a toggle button here that demonstrates I'm in view mode. I can, however, duplicate the scene and create my own copy. Now I'm in edit mode and I can make whatever changes to this scene I want and if interested, share it back to somebody else. Another advantage of perspectives and central perspective sharing in Bloom Full Access is this book icon that shows you when other users have made changes to the underlying perspective. Thanks for taking a few minutes to learn a little bit more about Neo4j Bloom Full Access Enterprise features. Used in conjunction with some of Bloom's other features, like search phrases, which allow developers or administrators to write powerful custom cipher queries that can then be run by analysts who don't need to understand the code, and deep linking, which allows developers to create custom URLs that will launch Bloom with a particular search run. These features really enable you to extend the power of Neo4j to more individuals in your enterprise. If you're not already a Neo4j user, why not get started today by going to neo4j.com and clicking on Getting Started, which offers a number of options to start experimenting with the Neo4j platform. If you're already a customer, definitely feel free to reach out to your Neo4j representative to learn more about getting a Bloom license key to access Bloom Full Access and all of the features that it offers. Thank you.